shit I never wrote. I ain't write this shit by the way, nigga. Some real shit right here. This is the realest shit you ever quote. My president is black, my Lambo's blue, and I be goddamn if my ribs ain't too. Mama ain't at home, daddy's still in jail. Trying to make a play, everybody seen the scale. My president is black. I'm Jack BJ, coming at you from the city of Detroit, Michigan, making out all the hottest nightclubs in the city. YBE, SBE, Jackson Rose affiliates, we coming after you. I think DJ BJ is a young black entrepreneur. I have three of my own businesses. And I'm really doing good for myself right now. I think music is just in my blood. I had a passion for being a DJ in my ninth grade year of high school, actually. I went to the club with my brother. I was only 15 years old. And we walked in, and the speakers was just so loud. I just really felt the music. And then now when I DJ, when I get behind the turntable, I feel like I am the club. Like, I, like without me, there is no party. Some of my biggest inspirations for being DJ is uh, DJ Mo Beats, DJ B Mac, and uh, it was a guy who grew up with me, DJ Limelight, that came on Mo Brown. Besides those, national, national wide is uh, DJ Jazzy Jeff, and I really look up to DJ Drama also. He's like one of my idols of being a DJ. My style of music is really an R&B, jazz type. I like to just ride and cruise. I still love my hip hop though, but uh, just me personally, more of a R&B jazz, just a smooth, mellow kind of type of group. Actually, I jumped to the field about five years ago, right after that. Um, my brother had some equipment in the basement, and we actually did our first party with a Big Heart album release party. All my sexy ladies saying, hell yeah! If you sexy and you know it, put your middle fingers up for the haters. Put your middle fingers up for the haters. Put your middle fingers up. It was pretty dope. He went away to college after that year. He had the equipment in the basement. He told me, do not touch my equipment. But you know, I went down there and messed with it just like a nosy kid. And off that, I blew up like I am today. Put up! Yo, oh my face! It's part B, baby! The crowd going, I think I'm more of a hype DJ. Most DJs I know play. Start off with slow music. Start off with just a little mellow. And as time goes on, they, you know, they crunk the party up. I think I'm the type of, the type of guy that likes the party crunk all the time. So I bring a totally different style of just a high party all the time. Something that is missing in Detroit that I feel like I bring to the table is a, a young artist, a young black male behind the turntables. I know when I be in the club, I be seeing old people, they be about 25, 30, you know, bald heads. And I feel like when I'm DJing and people look up at me and I'm the same age as them, it make them feel a lot better about the party. The club scene between Tallahassee and Detroit is extremely different. I feel like people in Detroit don't know how to party. People only go out to show how much money they got or just to get drunk. I think people in Tallahassee, they go out more for the more for the effect of having fun. Just trying to have a real good time with their friends. And in Tallahassee, it's more people from everywhere, all around the world. So just off that tip, you get to meet new people, new faces, new friends. Might even find a girlfriend or a wife there, you never know. Any artists out here looking for a DJ to host that mixtape, any groups looking for a DJ to host that mixtape, you can find me at DJ BJ Jackson on Facebook, or you can call me at 248-721-7052. I want to say thank you to all my fans. I appreciate y'all for coming to all my events. DJ BJ, check me out on Facebook. Coming to a event near you.